African universities have been challenged to embrace and deepen digital education towards achieving its desired impact. Dr. Olivier Coutel, the head of international affairs of Eco Polytechnique Federal de la Suisse, Switzerland, gave the charge while delivering a keynote address at the 2022 African Centers of Excellence Regional Conference in Abuja. Coutel, who acknowledged the impact of COVID-19, a driving digital transformation, urged universities in the continent to embrace online teaching, saying it is the way to go. I would say there is a whole world to be discovered when it comes to online education on how to do it, how to design it, how to have this planet of on-site teaching and online teaching. So this conference comes at the right moment. Let's think, think together about how can we actually uh, sustainably integrate digital education for our, the future of our kids and children. It will come at the cost. And we have to bear this in mind. It's not for free. There is a cost to it. But believe me, a growing share, especially here on that continent of African students, will certainly take advantage. Earlier, the Executive Secretary of the National Universities Commission, Professor Abubakar Rashid, indicated the decision that inspired the Commission to rethink its approach to adopt sustainable integration of digital education in Nigeria. We understood our poverty, poverty of ideas, our inability to continue effective delivery of lectures during the pandemic. There are few instances where lectures continued online, but essentially we were exposed. And we now realize that with Corona, we would have to rethink our entire approach to the delivery of our teaching body curriculum in the post Corona era, and that is through this theme, sustainable integration of digital education in the post era. We need to, we have to, we have no choice than to revisit our relationship with digital education with the technology to get our academics and non-academics to receive relevant trainings in course delivery. Other speakers, including the Minister of Education, Communications and Digital Economy, also reacted on the impact of digital education on the country. I believe that this conference will afford government officials, administrators of universities and faculty members attending this conference to address policy issues for sustainable and efficient integration of digital tools and technologies in education. I hope important issues such as proposing policies, encouraging exchange in good practices, in utilizing the CCODE and other silent matters that will promote the adoption of digital technologies in our institutions will be addressed. We hope that we'll be inspiring investors in Africa to add to allocate adequate budgets to develop the required infrastructure and services for the proper implementation of digital education to strengthen the quality of teaching as well as the competence of libraries in the participating universities. It is important to note that for sustainability of digital education and its integration, there needs to be a clear strategy defining the mission that is how to achieve a goal should therefore come to the fore at such a conference as this. The theme of the conference is Sustainable Integration of Digital Education in the Post-COVID-19 Era. CNA News.